A Romance of the Air A Romance of the Air is a 1918 American silent drama film based on the book and a Lair 1918 by Burt Hall, one of America's first combat aviators, flying with the famed Lafayette Escadrille in France before the United States entered World War I directed by Harry Revere. The film was heavily influenced by the exploits of Hall, who was featured plot. Flying with the French Lafayette Escadrille in World War I, American ace, Lieutenant Bert Hall. Bert Hall is wounded in an aerial battle and forced to land behind enemy lines. After finding his German opponent dead, Hall exchanges uniforms with him and is taken to a German hospital to recover. In the hospital, Hall meets Edith Day Edith Day, an old sweetheart from Kentucky. She was unable to escape Berlin when the war broke out. The pair are accompanied by Day's best friend, the Countess of Moravia Florence Billings, who claims sympathy with the Allied cause. The Countess, however, is actually a German spy. After stealing a German aircraft, the group escaped to France. Once the true motives of the Countess are revealed, Paul is accused of betraying the French government. After a trial by military tribunal, he is sentenced to be shot, but his American lover uncovers evidence that saves him at the last moment. Exonerated, Paul dedicates himself to destroying the network of spies run by the Countess. Cast Production The aerial scenes in a romance of the air were flown by Burt Hall at the Thomas Morse Aircraft Corporation airfield in New York. The aircraft that were used were Thomas Morse Smittis fours that were painted to depict French aircraft. The production was filmed with the cooperation of the War Department. Although mainly a dramatization of the aerial battles over France, a romance of the air also used newsreel footage of military aircraft. Reception